Welcome back to Character Select. My name is Dave, and I am on my own right now. Uh, I did not want to subject Hedra to this game anymore because she was clearly not enjoying it. But I didn't want to leave half of the game undone. So, having beaten the game as Zero, we're not going to play as X. Which kind of sucks because X's voice is terrible. Um... I wish I could switch back and forth between the Japanese track, but there's no subtitles in this game. Hey, look, it's Sigma. It's about the Maverick Hunters, General. They are far too eager to please the humans and continue to hunt down the Reploids. Do you believe they pose a significant threat? Perhaps. You already know the truth, General. Their sole mission has been to destroy any Reploids who fail to do as the humans order. It's in your best interest to stop them now before they turn on you. You possess enough power to destroy them! So there is actually, like, a side, a second so side of the story. You are dismissed. What? I will not betray the humans. Remove yourself from my sight. Kill my business him. With you has concluded. Kill him! It's fucking Sigma! Very well. But you will change your mind soon, I assure you. <laughs> so yeah, this X's storyline is far more focused on Repliforce than it is on X. And Zero storyline is focused more on Zero and Iris. Mavericks have been found at .5567. The Mavericks occupied the Sky Lagoon using the most advanced weapons available. The army appears to be the Repliforce. Roger that, I'm on my way now. Also, I fucking love X's theme in this one. Wow. Now, notwithstanding the fact that X's voice is terrible, this is one of the first X games where he's actually super cool. Like, he actually seems like he's a more experienced hunter than he was before. Come on. Get out of here. So, um, this was one of the first games that I ever got for my PlayStation on my own. I bought this. I love this game. This is like one of my favorite X games. Um, and again, notwithstanding the fact that the voices are terrible, at the time they were acceptable because I didn't know better. Um, but I'm really glad that this series actually went as long as it did. It ended on kind of a cliffhanger with X8. Um, only if you beat it in hard mode, but... Hey, Dragoon! You're Dragoon from the 14th unit! This is a good X. I would just destroy the power reactor. What? Then the Sky Lagoon will come crashing into the ground! It's too late, X. It's time I made my escape. I suggest you do the same. Don't do anything reckless on the way out, okay? Whee. The city below will soon become a sea of flames. Many people will perish. I have no choice but to escape from here and head to the city below. And it's not like you can evacuate people. You're fucked. Ready. Wah. Wah. The city's been completely destroyed. They were innocent people. I won't forget this. Um, also, I, I kind of wanted to use this opportunity to talk a little bit more about why I like the X series so much. Or even just Mega Man in general. Um, I really enjoy Mega Man games. Uh, because they always feel like you have choices and options for how to proceed and it's that's actually a big deal to me um i haven't been as big a fan of jrpgs since they got really linear and let's be honest there's a lot of jrpgs that are super linear um but like this is a platform game and it could just be a straight platform game it could be get from point a to point b like most of the platform games were back in the the early 90s. Um, but instead... Ooh. Got that. I'm gonna die. Um, but instead, they actually went out of their way to say, you know what? You can choose to play whatever stage you want. Have fun. And that was a big deal back in the day to me. Alright. Hey, giant dragon thing. I kicked your sh the shit out of your hands, and I'm going to kick the shit out of the rest of you. Also, the music in this game is actually pretty awesome. 
Oh, I can't shoot him in the legs? What kind of lame shit is this? Also, X has a far easier time in this game than Zero does. <laughs> Having range is a massively... Massively uh, counterbalancing force for good. You know. You know how it is. But yeah, this is going to be weird because this is technically a weekday series that's only me, but again... Just wanted to get the other side of the story. Who are you? I'm the Colonel of the Repper Force. Has the Repper Force been occupying this area? What are you talking about? I only came to save my sister. The army responsible for all the violence in this region is not the Repper Force. Nevertheless, I want you to disarm and follow me back to the HQ. Never. You're asking my soldiers to drop their weapons? The only time we drop our weapons is when we aren't able to fight any longer. But you'll be regarded as a maverick and treated as such. Do as you will. The Repler Force would sooner fight and die than discard our pride. Consider us mavericks if this is what you wish. Wait, calm down, Colonel. Yeah. You're kind of fucking going nuts there, buddy. What the? Something's gotta give. Otherwise, the entire Repler Force will be considered to be mavericks. And I did kind of allude to this earlier in the series, but um, the reason that Colonel refuses to disarm and come in is because he can't. He's a he's a soldier, and he's been programmed to be the perfect soldier, and perfect soldiers do not give up. Brave soldiers of Repliforce, we have all been wrongfully judged as mavericks. This cutscene is the same. We'll skip it. Dun -dun -dun. Who are you? Call me Double, the Rookie Hunter, my liege. What? The Repliforce has begun its coup. Wait, Colonel, you're jumping to conclusions here. Sir, you've been given the order to scramble. Right, I'm leaving right now. Yep, jungle, cyberspace. The levels are the same. The interactions with the characters are a little different. Uh, and I am going to try and get a couple of achievements that I did not get before. Um, one of which is just grabbing everything, the other of which is killing Dragoon with, uh, hitting, getting the last hit in the fight with the mech. I think I know how to do it, I haven't actually done it yet. But we're gonna fight with Web Spider first. Also, the boss order is entirely different because you get weapons! <laughs> As X, you have weapons now! Web Protects the secret weapon of the jungle. All right, sorry, I'm just messing with my timer here. Episodes are gonna go a bit longer than usual. Try and get this, you know, try and kick this one right in the butt to get it done quickly. But yeah, I mean, back in, way back in the day, um, my brother and I loved Mega Man games, and um, we would rent them all the time. The only Mega Man game that we actually ever owned was Mega Man 6. This battle should never have happened, X. Why must Reploids fight each other? Why do these peacekeepers persist in fighting each other? This must be some sort of mistake. How the fuck do you know about what's going on? X, enter this capsule. Equip this, or equip with this to discover the truth. Equip this boot module and jump twice in the air to hover. You can move either left or right and will remain airborne for a few moments. It is effective for negotiating through higher and more dangerous terrain. Stop this tragic war as soon as possible, X. Pwah. Bing. So, unlike the first three X games, it doesn't tell you, it doesn't give you a demonstration of what this does. I can now air dash. That's cool. But I can also just hover. It's kind of cool. But yeah, I've been playing the, the Legacy Collection pretty extensively in my spare time. I have every single achievement for the first three games. Um, which, which, considering the fact that I just recently finished them on the channel, should tell you how much I fucking love Mega Man. Ow. Whoop, 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 whoop. Dash, dash, jump, dash. All right, the only other thing here is a heart tank, which I can't get until I have um, a fire attack to burn the stumps, as we've seen. Stop shooting me, please. I'm really hoping I can defeat Web Spider. 
Like, seriously, I'm not actually entirely sure that I'll be able to. <laughs> die, 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 But yeah, the, the whole back, the whole story of the X series is taken far more seriously than um, the Mega Man series, with good reason. The X series, or the Mega Man series, if Wily wins, he just takes over the world. He's not going to actively kill anybody. In the X series, if Sigma wins, he's going to kill everybody. Human Reploid doesn't matter. He's going to kill them all. So he's crazy. And that's no good. Die. Yeah, you can see why X is, has a huge advantage in this game. The fucking X Buster is just devastating. I don't even have the upgraded version of it yet. Wait until I get, like, all of the armor upgrades. Because holy shit, X becomes insane. Lee overpowered, not insane. He never actually goes crazy. Uh, Mega Man Zero series notwithstanding. Um, I'm actually not as big a fan of the Mega Man Zero series because it places much more emphasis on technical skill than um, progressively getting better. Uh, in the X series, or in the Zero series, in order to power up, you have to use these things called Cyber Elves, which generally requires you to sacrifice them so that they give you new powers or something like that. Like, you sacrifice a Cyber Elf to get an energy uh, sub tank or you, you sacrifice the cyber elf to get more uh more health more maximum health um but every time you do that you lower your rank so in order to get the best rank in the game you have to not sacrifice anything and it's bullshit i don't like it i do like the story of the zero series but the actual gameplay is annoying oh yeah i can charge during cutscenes now yeah. okay hey what's up You've labeled us all as Mavericks. I won't let you pass. Turn back now. Well, I obviously can't do that. Ah. Cool. Woo! Getting really good at that dash jump off the wall. Woo! So much easier when I don't have to be right next to you. Oh, god damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Get off me, get off me, get off me. Ah, I'm dead. Oh, not yet. Time to get serious. Die. Ah. Here we go, phase two. It's like a Dark Souls boss. Ha 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 ha. Drop. Damn it. Nope, there I go. Thought I might be able to pull that one out of a hat, but I didn't. Also, X's X-Buster charging is so much flashier in this game. Like, do we need that glowing aura around him, like the circular aura? That's not cool. That's distracting. Hoo-ha. Ha. And here. Here we go. Ah, fuck, I jumped right into that. Oh, fuck you! Damn it! Bring it, bitch. No, don't bring it! I don't want to brought... Woo! Okay. Okay, now I got the rhythm of the rhyme. Now I got the magic of the beat. The jungle mix! Spiders. Spiders. Ah, fuck, 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 fuck. Come on, stop dodging. 
Eh. Time to get serious. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Damn it. Damn it. Ready. Okay. Let's try this again. <laughs> Warning. Forever. Do, 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 do. Sir, do you know you have a lightning bolt coming out of your butt? That can't be comfortable. Whoa, that was close. Also, one of my other favorite Mega Man games on the PlayStation, and uh, leave a comment down below if you agree with me on this one, is Mega Man Legends. Ah! Fuck that up. Oh, come on! Getting greedy here. No, fuck off. Come on. Getting mad. Might be tilting already. It's the first fucking boss. Ooh, speed lines. But I actually like how X's character kind of evolves in these games. In the first three, he's, like, unsure to actually skilled to fighting. And then in this game, he's, like, a vet. Veteran, not a veterinary. Technician. Fuck off. Ha! Okay, so if I only get him once on the downbeat, I can then jump over that. Oh my god, are you serious? He didn't come down far enough? Fuck you. Okay. Come on. Bullshit. Yeah, the webs don't hurt you immediately. They have to actually hold you for a second. Oh my god. No, fuck off. Get off of me. Gotcha! Fuck you. Fuck you right in your spider butt. Your lightning butthole. Okay. Da -na -na, da -na 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 -na. Jim, cut that out. You got lightning web. Lightning web. Shoot a web that you can also climb on. Use your attack, wall jump, or double jump. So X doesn't get a double jump the way Zero does. X instead gets the ability to use a web to do that. All right, next up on character select, uh, hopefully we'll take down two, maybe three bosses, but we'll see, because the next one's gonna be um, Split Mushroom. So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. And uh, somebody's keeping a death count, right? Keep a death count. Right, so thank you. I need I need continuity in my life. <laughs>